My name is Ray Marizzi. I'm the Director of Facilities for Cincinnati State Technical and Community College. We're responsible for taking care of three campuses. Uh, the main campus has uh, three major buildings on it. We have uh, two other satellite campuses. Together we probably take care of about a million point three square feet of buildings. It was very clear to me that we needed to upgrade our whole communication systems. And that was about the time that Mike Wiley came on board and um, he had a need that uh, we were creating a police department here at the campus and he had some definite communicational needs that he wanted to meet. One of the things that we, we wanted to look at with the new system uh, and why we wanted to replace the old system was it was analog. Uh, the new system, the Moto Turbo, is digital. That was a major concern of ours. Uh, the electronics were much better, reception was much better. Uh, we also looked at the financial end of it, and we were able to upgrade our system, which was anywhere from 12 to 15 years old, uh, at a reasonable cost, and still get quality service and quality product. Cincinnati State has been a long-term uh, client of ours. Uh, we've serviced their equipment for years. Uh, they're in a transition mode between a security force and a police force. They had a need to add a supervisorial channel that gave everybody the flexibility of going to that channel in any type of crisis without having to buy a new FCC license and for that matter also getting a new conventional repeater. Here at Mobilecom we use a team selling approach when it comes to our Moto Turbo uh, demonstrations. Uh, since the product is new it has a lot of digital features. Uh, we felt it was best to go out, have a technician, uh, go out to the customer site with our sales representative so we can bring both avenues of support uh, on the sales side and technical support as well to the customer up front. Uh, with the timing of our open house, that worked very well. They were able to come in and see the product uh, in person. Right, so at the open house, I was very impressed to see the uh, traveling unit that was brought in. It was, uh, there was a lot of information in there. The products were all on demo. You can hold them, touch them, feel them. Um, and we could actually see the demos of them and, and uh, the videos of them. We were very impressed. The model for the Moto Turbo we were using is 16 channel. Uh, one of those we use is an administrative channel. Uh, that afforded us the opportunity to carry on confidential conversations without everybody else hearing what was going on. At the open house, literally Cincinnati State asked me to give them a quote that day. They needed it for their trustees that evening. They were so motivated by what the product could show. And unfortunately, also with the Virginia Tech incident, the uh, trustees at Cincinnati State Technical Community College was very piqued and wanted to get something done right away. When we brought in the information and the specs and, and explained everything to the Board of Trustees, and to the college administration as to why we wanted to go with Moto Turbo, the options that had occurred, uh, that had for us, um, it was basically sold itself. When we came in and we were very confident with the system, they uh, basically referred it back to us and said, you're the ones that are going to be using it. If that's what you think you need to do, go ahead and do it. Turbo afforded us the ability to be able to communicate at a further distance. It gave us the ability also to be able to branch out and create multiple channels for our internal operations. And then we had a, the ability for security and facilities to come together on a channel and be able to communicate throughout the entire group. And that, that gave us the ability to communicate with the right people at the right times for the right reasons. The changeover went very smoothly. Um, probably most people on campus, and, and I know in our operations, that there was hardly a a down moment between the two, which was a concern of mine because I, I was concerned if, you know, going offline and going back into a new system, if there's going to be a, a down period, I mean, that could be critical if there's an emergency going on. Um, it went very quickly, very smoothly, and, and most people on campus probably didn't even know we switched over. The security repeater has 10 units on it uh, for all their officers. Uh, the facilities repeater has 40 users on it. Each one can be expanded out to several hundred users. Uh, and as they grow, I'm sure they'll add additional units on as necessary. The bottom line is, once you get the Moto Turbo product in the customer's hands, it absolutely sells itself. I'm very happy and pleased with the Moto Turbo product. It gives them, the customers, the clarity that they need, the flexibility of down the road. I now have the referral of Cincinnati State, which I'm using out in the road with all my customer base. They've been very pleased with the product been very open to have customers call them to explain how great the product is and the digital quality of it.